everyone, this is Kate Schwenke and welcome to my channel. Today I have a requested packing video for you featuring the brand new Be Moved by Jujubee. This is their brand new insert. This is coming out on April 3rd and I hope you guys will shop with me. I will leave my affiliate link right here for you as well as in the description below. I highly recommend these inserts. They are amazing and I'm super excited about them because they are a game changer for everybody that loves the super beat and has been wanting some structure in their life. This is perfect for that. So one thing I really quickly wanted to show you was just this is a freestanding insert as you can see. It doesn't require anything else. It is fine by itself even if you just wanted to tote this around by itself. Then this is the super bee by itself. I'll move this out of the way real quick. As you can see, no structure. Kind of falls over by itself, um, but a lot of people like that because you can easily take this, roll it up real small, and stick this into another bag. And you could totally do that, but if you are wanting to use this as your main bag, you can easily just unzip this, this is what the inside of the Super B looks like by itself, take the insert, this is really, really easy to put in because it's literally made for this bag. So that makes it way better and easier. Ta da! Instant structure to your Super B. I mean, it's freestanding now. So that's really awesome. I'll show you guys real quick. I'm not putting any pressure on it to keep it up, it's all by itself. This is the sides, back. It's pretty awesome. I, I love it. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you guys real quick that you can totally just pack with this insert already in. You can also pack it outside of the bag. It's really easy to remove. You can pack this on its own and then switch it in and out between bags. Also, I want you guys to keep an eye out for another packing video coming up next week and that is the Be Light version, and that is the Be Switched, so I can't wait to show you guys that as well. But first, let's go ahead and move on and pack these two up. So this is the top of the Super Bee. Let's go on inside. Now, this is a really, really awesome organizer, guys. I love it, and I highly recommend it. It gives so much structure to the bag and organization, because this bag really, as I showed you earlier, has no structure at all. And what I particularly love about the insert is the grab handles here, so you can really just take this out of the bag and move it directly into another Super B if you want. Because I know a lot of us ladies have way more than one Super B because they are such a great price and so versatile. So the first thing I'm going to go over is um, this key fob here. This actually comes inside of your Super B, and I just put my keys on there. And that I actually had in the very front pocket right here of the Be Moved. This is a super deep pocket and you actually have two on each side of the insert. So on this side here, I don't have anything. Like I said, I just don't believe in filling up every pocket just because there is one. I do have a couple things on the back pockets here. And here I have a little jacket for my 10 month old just to keep him a little warmer. Even though it's spring, it's still very cold out. I also have some toys back here for him. I have a little musical toy. I have a Sophie giraffe. And then I have some toy keys. Just to keep him busy while we're out. That's all I had on those back two pockets there. I actually don't have anything in this big long zipper here, but this is a fabulous pocket, guys. It's almost as big as the one on the back of the bag here, so I really like that. This is a great place for paperwork or a thin blanket, things like that. So everything else that I have is just on the inside organization of the Be Moved. So I'm just going to talk about the inside area first. On this side here, I have a fuel cell. This is a GGB fuel cell in the dot 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 print, super cute. And I'll just go through what I have in here real quick. This fits perfectly down in the middle of the insert, guys. I love it. So in here, this is what I have. I have just a few drinks for my boys. I have a Be Neat by GGB. I have a couple snacks, some of those go-go pouches. I have two of those. Then I also have some snacks for my little guy, some Cheerios. And then down at the bottom, I have a little Gerber dinner for him. And I also have a travel spoon. 
And I will link all this stuff down in the description for you guys as well. If you guys are looking for any of the stuff that I have in this bag, I will definitely link those down below for you. So that was the GGB fuel cell. Now, as you can see, the fuel cell took up a big portion of the inside of the bag. And if you didn't happen to have the need to have a fuel cell in there and you wanted to put something else kind of large on that side, you have your option to put a full size baby carrier in here. This fits just perfectly as well. So that's what I have there. You can still zip it all the way on top. So this is the Lilla Baby Organic Complete. So that actually fits really great down in there. Next in the middle here, I have a GGB medium set piece in the first lady print. In here, I just have a change of clothes for my little guy. So I have some socks. I have some pants rolled up in there. I have a little baby bear onesie rolled up in there as well. So it's just one change of clothes. He's usually pretty tidy, especially if I use the be neat with him. I don't usually have to change his clothes very often. That's all that was on the main inside part of the organizer. Everything else is in the pockets on the sides. So on this pocket here, this is a way big pocket. Um, what I have in here is barely fills it, but this is my son's 3DS and this is my seven year olds. So if we go down to Nashville, he can just play this on the way down just to keep him busy. That's all I have in there. On the other side over here, I have a GGB large set piece. In here I have all my diapering needs for my little guy. I have a wipe pouch 30 here. That's a wipes case and I love it, highly recommend it. And then I have four size four diapers. I also have a baggy dispenser down in there. So that's all I have in that. That's all that was on this side of the bag. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it around so you guys can see the other side. It is starting to lean a little bit because there's nothing else on the other side of the bag now. So I'm just trying to support it a little bit. So you also have these really great pockets on the sides here. These are perfect for baby bottles. They're perfect for swell bottles. They're perfect for nursing covers, anything that is tall and skinny. Um, I don't have anything on this one. You could definitely put a baby bottle on that side. I had the space to do it if I wanted to, but I am breastfeeding and I'm packed for that in this video. So on this side here, I have my 17 ounce swell bottle in the blonde wood color. I love this bottle, it's so pretty. So that was what I had on this side here, fit perfectly. And with room to spare, I really do think I could probably fit one of those 20 ounce traveler bottles in there as well. So next here, I only have one thing on the pockets on the bottom here, and that is my nursing cover. This is a Baby Olay Bamboo Blend nursing scarf. Super soft and super pretty, I love it. That's all that I had down on the bottom. On the top here, I actually have all three of these pockets utilized. I love pockets this size because as you can see, you could just really drop your small set pieces right in there. It's perfect for that. But on this side here, I have my four-year-old's iPod. He has some PJ masks on here. He has learning games. So I usually let him play this on the way down to Nashville if we're in the car for that hour ride. Next, I have my small set piece here and the first lady. In here, I just have a couple cough drops. You guys might notice my voice sounds funny. I am sick right now, so I have to carry these around for a little while. Um, but I have chapstick, I have lip gloss, blotting wipes, hand cream, a folding hairbrush, and a mirror down in there. In this last pocket over here, I just have my wallet. So this is my Be Charged. I love this thing and highly recommend the Be Charged. It's, it's just perfect, I love these. I also have another hand cream over here just to keep my hands a little bit more moisturized because it's still cold out. And that is literally all that I had in this insert, guys. I love it. Don't forget to go pick one of these up and a matching Super B for it on release day, which is April 3rd. And I would love if you guys would shop with me. I will leave my link right over here for you and in the description as well. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe while you're here. Thanks for watching.